Now, technical leader for Jamaica's team at the World Championships, Maurice Wilson, says he'll be taking legal action, or he's considering legal action, against a sprinter Taekwondo Tracy. Jerome Foster tells us more. Maurice Wilson's position stems from a social media post by Taekwondo Tracy earlier this week, where the former national champion vented his frustration over what he perceived to be his sidelining from the preparation of the men's sprint relay pool in Budapest. However, Wilson says Tracy's allegations were malicious, libelous and defamatory, hence his decision to seek legal recourse. The utterances were libelous, defamatory. My family is coming under attack on social media. The postings are out there. There is no way I will have to seek redress in relation to my reputation. I, track and field is a part of what I do. I'm also involved with youngsters that I mentor and I try to assist. So there's no way that I can allow this to just be a passing fad. Wilson went on to explain that it's up to Lennox Graham, the coach in charge of the men's sprint relay team, to use his discretion in putting together the team for the heats of the 4x100 meters. Taekwondo is not entitled to run on the relay. The three persons who are included in the pool are one, two, three at the trials. The coaches have the liberty to decide who are the other three athletes. As a matter of fact, we have gone, we have pulled hurdlers to run on the relay team when we were shot in, in, former, in former days. Long jumpers too. Long jumpers. And so the coach who was in charge of the team made the decision that Goldson was the next person he was going to look at. No final decision was made. Wilson also went on to explain how World University Games 100-meter champion Cadrian Goldson would have gotten the nod over Tracy for the heats of the event. The numbers are clear. Of five, five best times by each athlete, Tracy would have run 10.09 as his best time and goals to 9.94. Tracy 10.20, goals to 9.96. Tracy 10.21, goals in 10.04 seconds. Tracy 10.26, goals in 10.08. Tracy 10.27, goals in 10.11. No one is entitled, if you are not in the top three, to run on the relay. It is left to the discretion of the coaches to make that decision. That is the rule. And despite being dropped from the pool of six for Friday's sprint relay heat, Tracy remains with the Jamaican team. We met with him and we had frank discussion on both sides and we are pleased and we are happy that he will remain until his time is ready to depart with the rest of the team. Media liaison officer for Jamaica's team, Dennis Gordon, said no immediate disciplinary action will be taken against Tracy, but added that a report will be submitted to the J3As at the conclusion of the World Championships. A meeting was also held on Thursday with Tracy and other members of Jamaica's management team with the rationale behind the composition of the sprint relay team, as well as the protocols governing national teams competing at a global championship were also explained to the athlete. Wilson and Gordon were addressing members of the Jamaican media at a press conference at the team hotel on Friday. Jerome Foster, TVJ Sports.